Hey guys, it's your girl Misty coming back at you again with another video for you all. So today's video is going to be a little bit different than the other videos that I've shot before in the past, as you can tell by the title of this video. But nonetheless, I'm actually really excited to be doing this video for you guys. So let's go ahead and get started. So the product that I'm going to be reviewing today is the My Heritage DNA Kit. Now this video is in no way sponsored by My Heritage DNA, so I will definitely leave a link in the description box below if you guys wanted to go ahead and go get a kit from them. This kit was $79.99 and then $12.95 for shipping and handling. Now the more kits that you get, the cheaper the shipping and handling gets as well. So keep that in mind if you're gonna be ordering more than one kit, the shipping and handling does become cheaper. Now, the reason I went with my heritage DNA, honestly, I don't really know why. I just saw that they had it. I looked up DNA kits. This is one of the first one that came up and I clicked on it and bought my kit. So I was actually really pleasantly surprised by the results. It says that it takes anywhere from six to eight weeks to actually get your results. However, my results came within five weeks and I was shocked. Now I, was intending on actually filming when my results came in so you guys can get full-blown raw footage of my reaction to my results um but unfortunately i was just checking on the dna kit and where it was in that process and it automatically showed my results so i was like because ah, it wasn't supposed to be done until the 14th of june but it came a little bit early so without further ado let's go over the results so I have always been told my entire life that I was French, Swiss, and Scandinavian. That's it. And so I wasn't really going to be super, super surprised if it came back with those results. However, it didn't. And I was very, very surprised and my jaw hit the floor with the results. So I'm going to look at my phone. So I apologize for not looking at you guys, but I came up with a full 100% genetic makeup or not genetic makeup, sorry, a DNA makeup. Um, and that was really nice because it doesn't mean that there's anything mysterious. I guess I'm not really that rare, whatever. It's all good, but it came up with a full 100% of my DNA makeup. So the first one, it broke it down into three major groups. So the first one is North and West European which it really didn't surprise me because North and West European is comprised of France, Switzerland, Belgium, the Netherlands, and Germany. So Switzerland's in there, not a big shocker to me. French is in there, not a big shocker to me. So that was, that was really surprising. I thought it would for sure be a little bit more since I was told I was basically made up of Swiss, French, Swiss, French, and Scandinavian. I thought it was definitely going to be more, but it wasn't. The next one with a whopping 44.8% is English. So from the United Kingdom, again, I've never been told I was English at all. I, I never have been told that. So it was surprising to me that it did come up with that, but that only makes up 95%. So there are the last little 5%, which is probably the one that shocked me the most. Uh, it says that I am North African. So from Morocco, Algeria, Libya, and Egypt. I was seriously pleasantly surprised by that. The results were outstanding. I thought it was just a super amazing little mind trip for me, I guess. Um, my mom also did this DNA kit and she came up, if I'm not mistaken, I believe it was 89% North and West European. And then let me see, I have her results here. Um, North and West European. And then, so it was 88.6% of that. And then 11.4% of Irish, Scottish, and Welsh. Now I'm going to insert a picture right here. And this is a picture of myself, my mom, and my brother. This is the main reason why I wanted to do this test because as you can tell, my brother, we both have the same parents as far as I know, but my brother is a lot darker than I am. So I really want him to take this DNA test as well as my father because I want to kind of see where it's coming from. But yeah, I was just pleasantly surprised by that. So like I said, I will put a link in the description box below for the My Heritage DNA kits if you guys want to get yours today. 
If you guys do, let me know down in the comments below what your guys' results were. If you have done this or if you've done a different one, let me know your results and if you guys were surprised by this at all or not, or if you guys knew your heritage already, but let me know down in the comments below what your guys' results were as well. If you guys like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you guys have not subscribed to my channel, please do so because it is free. And until next time, see ya.